Hello everyone and welcome to part 3 of my sniper tutorial. Alright you guys, so keeping up, keep checking out my channel. I've gone up to 48 subscribers, about to break 50. And <clears throat> keep checking out. Hello ladies, 1, 2, 3. So I don't know my friends lost and even on my subscribers. So check those out. He's got, he should be coming out with some new tutorials soon if not already <coughs> and today we're gonna keep working on our sniper so as you can see we have this part so far now what we're gonna do is just click a point and hit control L and it selects any point connected to it hit 3 hit E extrude region just bring it down to just got to play around with it, probably right about there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna make it a little bit thicker than this. Alright, now with this selected, hit Control L again, hit a three key, and bring it up to make it kind of this part in the middle of these. Now, what this does is it adds a little bit more uh, type of definition to the game, you know? It adds like <clears throat> it adds like different levels to the game and it makes it look a lot cooler. So what we do now is we hit K, loop cut, get it lined up with that one, and bring it out and try and line it up so that we can merge those points really easily. Sorry. <clears throat> And then do it again. Uh. Oh, jeez. It's got to find the right. There we go. Alright. Next. Start from the bottom. Select here. Shift. Select here. W. Merge. At last. Make sure you're merging them. Whoops. Sorry, I must have not selected the right point. Yeah, you just hit Control Z to undo if you select the wrong point. Make sure you're merging it to this point, all right? So W merge at last because that's the one I selected last. All right. Um, K loop cut, loop cut right here, and line it up with that point right there. Do this again. Shift, select oops, shift, select that one. W merge at last. Next level. Just keep doing this all the way up. <clears throat> uh you don't have to make it a different level, like you could make it like all the butt stack lined up with the gun part if you want to, but I like to make it to give it a little bit make the gun look cooler. Kind of makes it look, you know, yeah. <laughs> the top point, skip this point, W, merge at last. Whoops, hold on. Control Z. Hit K, loop cut. You really need to like get all the points merged for it to look good. Into object mode, check it out. There you go. And no blemishes at all. Looks very cool. Alright, so go back into edit mode. Hit 7. And now what we have to do is we've got to get the trigger. Alright? So, <clears throat> to get the trigger, we don't have to start right where S tells us to start on this. You can start a little earlier. But we're going to have to K loop cut it. So that way we have a point to extrude. Right there. Alright. Select these points. Oops. Oh, hit B and select these points because it's a, it's a two-sided object now. Move it to there. K loop cut. 
Move it to right about there for the trigger. All right, next, go to this kind of view. Okay, loop cut, get here, bring it to right about there. Okay, loop cut, bring it to right about there. Doesn't have to be perfect to, to make them even. All right, seven, go to face select. Click here and make sure you have this face selected. Hit seven, hit E to extrude, right click, then just drag it down to right about there. E to extrude, right click, bring it down to right about there. E to extrude, right click, bring it to right about there, and go into that mode. And now we've got to merge these points. Click here, click here. Oh, start at the bottom always. W, merge at last, because we want to merge it to the gun. We don't want it to merge to the trigger. Just got to get a better angle. Alright, <clears throat> next, go back into the face select, select right there, seven, E to extrude, E to extrude, E to extrude, E to extrude, and extrude some points, and that way you can like, kinda get cool curves, wait hold on, I'm sorry, alright go back here, E to extrude, bring it down, and then kind of curve it, curve it again, one more, there, see it gives kind of a curve to the trigger, <clears throat> so then you go into object mode, there you go, and that is part three of my sniper rifle tutorial, thank you.